Good morning, you guys. Can you hear that? There are literally elk just everywhere around me. This is so amazing. I wasn't expecting this at all, honestly. Uh, I felt like a little paddle today, so I came out with my inflatable kayak and got that set up well before light. It's not even completely light yet. Uh, but yeah, I got it set up while it was still dark and I started paddling and I had the moon to to guide me on the river and it was just amazing such a cool experience and uh, I came out here just curious to see what wildlife I would be able to uh, see and hear and there is just so much out me out here I mean I, I don't know if you can hear that but there are literally elk just everywhere around me and uh, I already got some this morning I, I had some actually cross the river in front of me there was some lingering fog and they started crossing in the river and uh, I came over to the bank just so I wasn't you know bumping all around in the kayak I, I came over to the bank and got a little bit of footage of them crossing and what an awesome scene how amazing is stuff like that it was so cool and they're still just everywhere around me. I can hear them everywhere. So I'm hoping that I can still get some additional footage of them. Uh, hopefully some pictures when it gets a little bit lighter. Sun's just barely coming up now, getting some color in the sky. Just a fantastic morning. Uh, there's so many birds everywhere that I've heard and seen. And so I'm just, I'm hoping to get some awesome footage this morning. Just such a beautiful, beautiful morning out here. So uh, I'm gonna keep going, see what I can find, because this is just absolutely a stunning morning.
so absolutely beautiful area that I'm paddling through right now. Uh, as I was paddling up the river, I uh, heard some kingfishers, a pair of kingfishers, a male and a female. And so I uh, kind of sat back for a while and watched them. And they've been flying around in this area and there's multiple perches that they're using. Um, they flew off down the river a little while ago chasing each other. I'm not sure what they're doing, playing tag or something, I don't know. But um, uh, while they're down that way, I figured I'd haul up here and there's a nice log up here that I'm gonna hide behind. And I've got my ghillie net in my uh, backpack. So I'm just gonna hide up here uh, kind of by some of these perches that they're using and hopefully uh, they'll come back and I'll be able to get some pictures of them. Kingfishers are generally very flighty, very skittish, and uh, if they know you're there, they won't come in. So I'm gonna, yeah, use that ghillie net, get all set up, hopefully get some pictures. I've also seen a bunch of, uh, I believe they're mergansers. I'm probably butchering that name. And uh, again, I'm just pretty sure that's what the bird is. I'm no bird expert, so. Uh, you bird experts who are watching this, correct me if I'm wrong, but uh, I've been seeing some of those guys uh, swimming around here as well. So we'll so see what we can get here. Uh, just beautiful morning out here. It's so pretty, but uh, yeah, I'm gonna get I'm gonna get hidden here before those kingfishers come back. I don't want to have them see me trying to hide from them in the process of doing that. So uh, let's go do that and see what we can get. Those kingfishers are so much fun. I've been wanting to photograph kingfishers for so long now. Uh, so that spot was awesome. I'm gonna have to remember that spot because there were these three uh, perches on this old log that was um, hanging over the water, uh, actually in the water a little bit. And uh, I had noticed them, you know, sitting on those before when I had seen them. So, uh, you know, I got everything hauled out and I found this really cool tree stump that was like half carved out and it was huge. So I was able to hide in that little nook uh, in the carved out section. So my back and sides were hidden. And then I set my tripod up with the camera and the ghillie net in front of me. Uh, so I was hidden pretty much all the way around. And sure enough, uh, the kingfishers came in, both of them came in. Uh, female came in first and then the male and they just kind of sat there for a little while the sun had come up and uh, Hit the water so I was able to get some uh, fog moving around behind him. Just fantastic beautiful scene. Oh, I love this elk <laughs> but uh, Yeah, just beautiful scene 
and uh, the female actually dove into the water, dived into the water, dove. It's too early for grammar, I'm sorry, but uh, <laughs> you know, the female, I'm gonna go with dove, dove into the water. Uh, I wasn't able to get that on camera, but uh, it was just cool to see. You know, I've never watched kingfishers before. It's a, it's a bird, or I've never photographed kingfishers before. It's a bird I've been wanting to photograph for quite some time now. I just haven't made the time to do it. So, you know, this was a great little teaser, you know, morning for me with these guys. And I'm gonna have to remember that spot because it was awesome. And uh, I'm definitely gonna be coming back to that. Fantastic morning though, you guys. Oh, and I forgot to tell you, uh, those, I, again, I believe they're called mergansers. Correct me if I'm wrong. But uh, they came in just briefly, uh, swam in front of my little stump that I was hiding behind for a little while. And uh, they're funny because, you know, they're swimming against the current and they do this funny little like running on water type deal. <laughs> I don't know. I, I'll, I'll show you what I mean, but um, you know, it's, it's cool. They kind of just snake up the water by running slash swimming, I don't, I don't know. Cool birds though, very, very cool. Fantastic morning. I'm gonna keep going, that sun, uh, it's getting pretty high, so I'm gonna start making my way back. I've still got a, a while to go till I get back to where I started. And uh, by the time I get there, the sun's gonna be pretty harsh. So uh, if I see stuff on the way back, then I'll, uh, I'll get that for sure. But uh, you know, great morning, you guys. Enjoy the season. This is a beautiful time of year. If you haven't been able to make it out yet, you know, try to, try to set some time aside to do so because this is just a beautiful, beautiful time of year to uh, get out. Get out there, you guys, be safe, have fun on your adventures, and uh, we'll see you next time. Have a good week. Thank mm -hmm. you.